Princess Catherine has been praised by singer Tom Walker who was left pleasantly surprised when they performed together. Tom, 31, was left shocked when it emerged he and Catherine would be performing together at Westminster Abbey, with him singing and the princess playing piano. The Scotsman who has amassed millions of fans with his powerful vocals was left impressed by the future Queen's skills but admits she won't be collaborating on his next album. The pair performed a festive rendition of For Those Who Can't Be Here, with millions at home and those at the ceremony speechless as Catherine took to the stage. Speaking exclusively to the Mirror at Hits Live Manchester about performing with Catherine, 41, Tom said, I think that was her one and only gig and possibly song, I'm not sure she's planning on making a career of it. Although Tom admits it was daunting to be working alongside the Princess of Wales, who was then the Duchess of Cambridge, he added, she was absolutely lovely to me, a great piano player, she's just a lovely person but it was quite daunting at first. It went to plan, which was nice. She's very lovely, her team were very nice, it was a really nice day. But while Catherine may not have any plans to work on music, Tom is preparing for the release of his second album, I Am, which is slated to be released in May 2024. Speaking about the record, he explained that his tunes are like therapy for him to share his thoughts with listeners. I'm just buzzing to get new music out, get back on the road and play festivals, it's been a long time in the making, he gushed. And touring is what he'll be doing. Next year, Walker is embarking on a mammoth tour of the UK, with dates continuing to sell out. Responding to the reaction, he said, It's been amazing, we sold Manchester out in a week and a bit, we've had to put another date on. It's the same with Glasgow. I'm buzzing that people want to come and see the show. Singers are known to dread their second album, with Tom reflecting on his upcoming release saying, I guess it's that thing of the dreaded second album which has been difficult. Especially with the pandemic and trying to write at home when you're not seeing anybody is a bit tricky. As soon as everything started opening again, I started doing festivals and gigs and they really inspired me and I got quickly back into it. I'm really happy, it's taken a lot longer than I had hoped but he'll get there in the end. The star admitted he was absolutely buzzing to be performing at Hits Live at Manchester's Our Arena, close to where he grew up. I came to watch all the gigs growing up with my dad here, it was the men at the time, he said, before revealing it was a bucket list moment for him. Follow Mirror Celebs on Snapchat, Instagram, Twitter, Facebook, YouTube and Threads.